Right, nearly 70 people are dead, more than 100 still missing in the tornado outbreak that spanned eight states. The destruction is so great, it may be more than a week before there is a final count on the lives lost. The age, the age range is five months to 86 years and six are younger than 18. The death and devastation overwhelming Kentucky's governor as he announces the ages of some of those killed following this past weekend's deadly storms. Help keeps pouring in from all over the country. Um, thank you. The fast moving storm system swept through eight states, destroying thousands of structures, flattening entire communities. Glass broken, all the furniture tore up broken. Um, it's just, it's just sad. The death toll expected to rise. Among those killed, 29-year-old Navy veteran Clayton Cope, who died when a tornado caused an Amazon warehouse in Illinois to collapse. He was a, a wonderful, caring person, and that his presence will be a huge void in so many lives. Federal officials promising to offer whatever help is needed, but the damage is catastrophic. Now on the third day of recovery efforts, the sheer scope of the work ahead is becoming apparent to those who have lost everything. You know, where we're standing, it's going to be weeks on end. And, and I say weeks and it could be longer, um, we'll, but we'll do everything we can to do it faster. If we can, we will. Just awful. President Biden will visit two of the hardest hit areas in Kentucky Wednesday. FEMA is on the ground setting up help centers and the president has approved a major disaster declaration for Kentucky.